right? Drug of choice was caffeine and I am on it today. <laughs> Joy told me a bit about the book. I think it's going to be an amazing read and good gift. Thanks, Yos. That's right. Yos is a good friend of mine. He's an entertainer as well, artist. I miss my artist friends. I mean, we chat. He's in Amsterdam in the UK. We met in the UK doing some charity work, church. We go to the same church. Amazing person. Um, you know, I think that my best friends are artists who think outside the box. And the people who stuck with me after the politics and the craziness and me becoming a huge celebrity and then me disappearing for a few years to do charity work and then me coming back and sort of figuring it out with a podcast and with new music and then this and that. And now, you know, getting married, getting divorced and all of these things, the ups and downs of life, the waves of life, the people that stuck with me are the people who understand that I am a human being a multifaceted diamond and that I am going to go through different waves in my life and that's okay. And you don't have to agree with everything I say or everything I do. And Joy Tribe, you are a huge part of my life. You guys have stuck with me when I didn't do lives for a couple months and I was figuring my shit out and now I'm back and I'm in a new renaissance and you guys are in a new renaissance, I feel like. I mean, when I ask you guys how you're doing, Joy Tribe, and you guys, I'm reading the comments. I'm reading all the comments on Facebook, on Instagram, on YouTube. And I'm going, you guys are real people. And you guys also had a tough year in 2023. And you want to have a renaissance and a new life in 2024. That's what my podcast is about, The Joyful Life. My book, The Five Pillars of Joy. If I can bring you joy by being myself, 